NASA, meanwhile, is revising its Mars sample return project after a review stated that its budget and schedule is simply unrealistic. The independent review concluded that a planned sample retriever lander and Earth return orbiter have a near zero probability of being completed by 2027 or even 2028. It's also raised some questions about the staggering $8 to $11 billion budget. A NASA team is looking to review the recommendations. It will suggest alternative architecture on the Mars project by the month of March. And this architecture will focus on total and pre-war costs as well as ways to find smaller orbiting samples. NASA is collaborating with the European Space Agency, which is responsible for the Earth Return Orbiter and a robotic arm for transferring the samples. Both are in fact working to bring Mars material to Earth for a detailed study. Now, the Mars Perseverance rover is the first leg of this international interplanetary relay efforts. Its job is to collect and also cache samples on Mars. Once the sample cache leaves the red planet, another spacecraft will capture it in Mars's orbit and it will be brought to Earth in early to mid-2030s. Now, these samples are expected to answer a key question. Did life ever exist on Mars? the lowest down rocks in the sequence of rocks that we have in there. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.